one, two, three, four, man. Summer has been great. I have two guys that came late. It was Isaiah Cousins and Steve Navarita. Um, Isaiah didn't get out of school late, and Steve is the same thing. He decided to enroll in the second uh, part of the summer. Everybody else was here with me the entire summer. And uh, as we know, the new legislation allows them to also have individual skill workouts combined with weightlifting. And uh, this has been probably the best summers, meaning I think finally I've established a certain level of order. I have guys that have been with me for three, two years and know how we do things at the program. They know that if they come here, I tell them on their visits, if you're on time and you like to work hard, we're gonna have a great relationship. And Coach Kruger does the same thing. So on the same page. And that's really simple, but it can get complicated because you will make a mistake, you will be late, you're not gonna work hard, and I will be there to hold you accountable for your actions, because that's my job. You know, as, as, as a coach, as a parent, cousin, we all the things, you know, but that's just my job. And, uh, and I think the guys appreciate that. This is the foundation. This is where I'll be the foundation for the year. I mean, started in March, April, and the summer is really when the new guys come in and jump on the train, get on the wagon with us, because we have been moving. And I know it's been disappointing seasons. Uh, we haven't worked any less harder because we have failed to succeed in games. You know, I'm not, I don't feel that, you know, we're working harder, I think we're more efficient. We're becoming more efficient and we're maximizing what we have every day. And we're becoming to where we stay humble and we stay hungry and come ready to work every day. We can do that. The teams that can come ready to work every day and get better now when there's no one looking, when the media is not on your, you know, watching our every move, you know. Uh, we have a test every week twice, test being a game. That's why I like sports. Right now there's nobody really looking. But this really shows later in the year. Because you can be a toughness, obviously beyond just physical ability and, and movement and core strength and all that. But I'm trying to build toughness. I'm trying to build what's going on between the two years, those five inches. That's where the game is played. So where we feel <coughs> devastated every time we don't succeed because we're putting so much. You know, it's got to hurt. You know, it's just got to hurt. And it only is going to hurt if we are all very committed and we are just all in, both feet in. We have a good tone. We have a great base. And those guys are hungry to, to feel success. And that's how I want them to feel success. You know, whether winning or losing, but people happen to like winning more. You know, it's more fun. I always tell them like, hey, you know, what's about winning? Well, then we're gonna have that kind of attitude, you know, from great effort spring great attitude. So, I mean, from great attitude brings great effort. And that's what we got every day. You know, I tell them all the time about order, work, discipline. We gotta do it every day. And the new guys, Jalon Hornby, Isaiah, Buddy, I mean, these guys are guys that have a chance to maybe start every game here. So I like the competitiveness of the crew because they're great recruits. We have great guys here. Some practices are going to be great. You can already tell. You know, we have guys in the gym all the time. Gym rats. We have gym rats. And that pushes guys that maybe weren't come to the gym before because they were comfortable with the, with the situation to get out of the comfort zone and push themselves.